Sean had to be prepared to play as much as Thad had to be prepared to play. And, and he was really locked in, really focused, learns really quickly, asks great questions, and, and is able to answer tough questions. So, so while Thad and I were, were spending a lot of time communicating, uh, Sean really soaked a lot of it in and participated. He was always a competitor, watching Thad compete, come back every play, whether he scored a touchdown, whether he got a big hit. Uh, he came back and he was willing to compete every play to see what it's like in a game, how the speed is different, how you need to manage the game, be prepared. I think all that was something that's going to help me in this upcoming season. Oh, he went down. Look bad that's up. He twisted his leg as he went down. Obviously a tough injury for any football player, but, but from the time that it happened till now, he's been 100% um, geared to be as prepared to play for the first game as he possibly can. So I think he's obviously going in the right direction. He's getting stronger every day, getting more mobile every day, getting more confident every day, and, and um, that's what's got to happen. I felt comfortable with the spring. Obviously, I was able to come back more and more as the sp spring progressed. Um, and I felt comfortable towards the end. And obviously for the fall, I'm going to be 100%. Right now I'm excited. I can't wait to get, for it to get here. But uh, obviously I'll see. And I'm going to be prepared either way. So I'm looking forward to it. I think he has the, the right demeanor, the mentality, the work ethic um, that, that you need in a quarterback to help you win football games. But it's, I think what his greatest quality is, and, and we'll find out, is you have to be an accurate passer. And, and I think he's an extremely accurate passer.